what is up you guys welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for clicking on this video if you are new here welcome i hope you stick around and join the family to do so all you have to do is click my subscribe button down below and hit that bell button so you will never miss when i post a new video so if you clicked on this video you are going to ue or you want to know about the process of applying for housing and renting apartments in barbados i recently found out i will be returning to barbados physically in person because my faculty will be holding online and face-to-face -face classes and so i'm going back physically and so i think this video will be helpful to students who are going back and are in the same situation as i am if their faculty allows them to have both online and face-to-face -face formats so yeah if you got accepted to ue and you're watching this video congratulations to you i really hope that it helps you out in some way and i hope that your academic year will be awesome despite the situation that we're in right now but anyway since you got accepted you should have gotten a form that says on campus accommodations and i really think you should fill that out so that you can get an opportunity to live on campus or on halls as they call it if you are a person who does not want to share the communal bathrooms if you are afraid of too much noise happening on campus and stuff like that which i doubt will happen seeing as we are dealing with covid and stuff like that that then on campus is not for you however if you are fine with it I really recommend that you stay on campus because everything is within your reach and it will be so much easier for you to get around um, in Barbados and just being on campus so you can go to classes easily but if that's not for you then off campus is for you I did I lived off campus and so I'm very happy that they are flexible in that aspect so if you are planning on living off campus my suggestion to you is to go onto the UEK Hill website scroll down until you see campus life and then you click the link that will take you to the campus accommodations and i think there's another link that should take you to the off-campus accommodations page it's going to be called it's chill people call it chill i call it sea hill i'm just weird anyway i call it chill off campus accommodations page and you should see a bunch of different houses available for students to rent some may say occupied obviously the students are still um, renting that building you should see different houses that are available for students and they are currently updated on that website so everything should be fine once you go on to it if you know of places in barbados already and you want to modify that search and search specifically for that place that you know of then you can do that as well but just have a browse through see what is suitable for you you can look at how far from campus the house is what it entails what the rent includes and all of that speaking of rent okay let's talk about the prices they range from five hundred dollars up to maybe a thousand two thousand dollars depending on what you find obviously there are some nine hundred to two thousand or a thousand if it's even that ridiculous are mainly for students who want to rent studios but those of you who are sharing with other students and how modern the house is the prices would obviously go down to split the cost amongst the students now when you are looking for a house and you're looking for a decent rent please ensure that your rent entails all the different utilities because some houses may be rented for 500 billion dollars but you have to pay for the utilities separately so you may have to pay for electricity separately you have to pay for electricity and water electricity water and internet electricity water internet and gas so please ensure that your rent includes everything before you decide to rent that house in my case my rent is 600 billion dollars flat and everything is included for me however i had four other roommates and so it was a five bedroom house with three bathrooms and so that makes sense as to why my rent is so low however i'm very fortunate and thankful that my rent includes everything so please search wisely for a house that has a suitable rent suitable location and have everything included within it for my recommendations in finding off-campus accommodations as well you can look to your island association it's basically any other country outside of barbados even barbados has is basically trying to help foreign students to feel as if they're home it's basically a group of students from the same country who stick together do different activities together have culture days really helps the student who's not from barbados feel as if they're back home so when you're looking for housing you can try to contact people within your island association related to Cave Hill because there are island associations for all the campuses Hill and try to get in contact with your welfare officer that person is in charge of helping students helping their members find housing helping them settle in because they are supposed to be in contact with either people from the university or people who are renting houses I'm not sure in the case of my island association they help students get in contact with people who have houses my island association is obviously the antiguan barbados student association and so in my year they really went around and they went around and they helped different students get housing introduced them to different people and they initially i wanted to live by myself but after living with them i had so much fun 
and you just never know what could happen to you if you're by yourself and so i would highly highly recommend that you try to room with more than one person try to live in a group try to find people from the same country as you if you're comfortable with that if you want to try to branch out and live with people from different countries you can also try that don't try to live by yourself but if you are a person who is really introverted you don't like being around other people then studio apartments are for you lastly my recommendations for different places to live in barbados my top three would be oxnards west terrace and wanstead well i can add a little fourth that would be black rock but i I think Oxnard and West Terrace and Wanstead, these are very good places. They're very close to campus. I mean, Black Rock is the closest of all, but I just prefer those three over Black Rock and they're en route with the Zadas. Zadas are buses that take you like to town. They're en route with the campus shuttle. I think those three areas are pretty good because students have been asking me for recommendations on where to live in Barbados. They've been asking me how I feel about where I lived. They even asked me where I live <laughs> and I don't think that's possible for me to reveal because of privacy reasons obviously and I am still living there and the house that I'm living in is full at the moment. Yeah, I really hope those places will help you out. Please continue to look on the website, contact the people at UWE if you are still unsure or try to get in contact with your island association to ensure that everything goes well. I really hope that you guys get through with everything. I hope this video was helpful. Please continue to stay safe and stay positive. Stick around for my other college videos. I'm going to be doing a pack with me for college, a college moving video. Lots of people liked that one. For some reason, it's so cringy. But anyway, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Stick around for my other videos because I'm going to be posting another one next week. And please subscribe down below. Please hit that bell button so you will never miss when I post a new video. I'm trying to grow my channel. Comment anything you want to comment on in this video. It could be an emoji. Just please be a nice emoji. Please be nice in the comment section. Sharing this video with someone who you know is going to Yui. Anything. Thank you guys so much for watching. And stay tuned for the next video that I have coming for you guys. Stay awesome. Sure.